Today marks 35 years since the first coup led by members of the Buputatswana Defense Force held ministers and the president of Buputatswana, Lucas Mangope, hostage with the intention of forcing them to resign. But the South African Defense Force stormed the Mabatu Stadium to free the Bantustan leader and arrested the soldiers. One soldier was killed and several others injured. Those involved were later charged with treason. They were kept in a nearby correctional facility and only released after democratic dispensation. After their release, they were unable to work in any military service, struggle to find employment elsewhere, and are also not receiving a military pension. They say the decision to overthrow the Buputatwana government was taken because the area was no longer conducive. We liked the homeland governments to be eradicated. The reason being that we wanted a united non-racial and non-sexist South Africa. Jaka the Freedom Chata Ibuwa. Kayalo, we wanted that to happen. And we are very happy that at least we did achieve that. Long live the spirit of Comrade Pecha, long live. An ANC member who was instrumental in the coup says they actively recruited members from law enforcers in Buputatswana. We had uh, uh, internal people, people who were in the police, who were actually uh, 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 working with the underground structures of the African National Congress. Even in the defense, we had people. So those people had to do that, but at all material times, we had to avoid bloodshed. But those involved say they are now paying the price. This day really hurts me a lot because even today our government does not assist us with anything. She says her husband was a soldier and he died and they are suffering and one of their children was killed on the 21st because of drugs. We were fighting for salary increase. We were earning about 280 per month. The Department of Military Veterans has made an undertaking to look into the reasons why these soldiers are not receiving any compensation. Zeblon Maine, SABC News, Mahi.